the three loudest noises in the world. One, foghorn. Two, nuclear warfare. And three, this. Should have been a Hi, welcome to the Trashler. I'm Callie, and Oh Holiness definitely watches my videos, right? I hope everybody wore their most comfortable lingerie. This could be a finasco tonight. Right? Before the women tell all, we quickly wrap up last week's fantasy suite episode with a rose ceremony. The best sex awards go to Hargnarn and, mysteriously enough, the Virgin Maddie. Sure. Which means. Bad Witch Victoria is going home. Now, I actually hate the Women Tell All episodes because it's all drama and no hooking up. So instead, I'm gonna focus on something more positive. The glow ups, darling. The rest of this episode was so annoying that the only way I could mentally cope was by imagining Donkey from Shrek's voice coming out of the girl with the infinity tattoo on her finger's I'm mouth. Trying to listen to her are I just didn't, so rude. I didn't I'm, rehearse okay. this. In the morning, I'm making waffles. Pilot Forney Potter and his parents, who I believe are way too involved in this season. Is anyone with me on that? Crash some bachelor viewing parties and <laughs> what the hell? What's a girl gotta do for an invite? Oh, not make videos and watch the episodes with people? Pass. In probably the most unexpected twist, former Bachelorette Your Majesty Rachel Lindsay comes out to educate the children about racist and hateful comments online. Kill yourself. I honestly love this part. But no, I will not get rid of my voodoo doll of the girl with the infinity tattoo on her finger. Groundbreaking. My winner of the week is Your Majesty Rachel Lindsay's skincare routine. <laughs> Are you kidding me? This glow, this radiance. My loser of the week is, you guessed it, feminism. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time for the finale. Ah! You know, after our first one-on-one, -on -one, just hanging out, date portion, and I'm really excited for tonight to have an honest conversation with her, and uh, and to see where we're at. Oh my God.